just broke the window, I believe, on the house. With the sheriff's helicopter directing officers below to the suspect. Running towards the front yard at 29th Street. The two officers run along a side yard, chasing a man who witnesses reported was breaking car windows on South Sacramento's 29th Street. Hey! Show your hands! They run into the backyard. In the next seven seconds, the officers believe they see Clark with a weapon and start shooting. Show me your hands! Gun, gun, gun! Five, seven, shots fired, seven, eight, go! Show me your hands! I see your hands! The officers later explaining to a sergeant why they fired. What do you have on him? Like this, something in his hands, it looked like a gun from our perspective. He came up and then he he kind of approached us, hands out, and then yeah, he fell down. down. But when they finally approach, this officer realizes there was no weapon. If one of you guys want to go hands, cover him, I... Oh, Just a cell phone. The suspect is later identified as 23-year-old Stefan Clark, a father of two who lived with his grandparents at the home where officers shot him. Police releasing the video just three days after the incident. We have released this video very quickly because we know the significance of this event in our community and there's still a lot of answers that we're looking for, but it is still very early. Councilman Larry Clark looked over the video and says in his opinion, it isn't clear if the officers followed protocol. It's hard to say. It's not clear. Uh, it, you can't see the individual uh, coming from behind the building and uh, it's, it's just not clear enough for me to make a determination. Police showed this footage to the family before making it public, but some of Clark's closest relatives still haven't watched the videos, saying it's too painful. We're, we're doing bad right now, you know what I mean? We're just trying to get through this. We're now, the family has hired an attorney. She told us she saw nothing in the video that justified the use of deadly force. Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg issued a statement after the videos were released. He says, in part, we have made great progress over the last year, and there is no question there is still much work to be done to break down walls and build trust between the men and women who serve us and the communities they serve. 